President-elect Trump's pick for Education Secretary Betsy DeVos is scheduled to be on Capitol Hill Tuesday for her confirmation hearing. The national spotlight on education will come following a major announcement from the CEO of J.P. Morgan Chase. Jamie Dimon is vowing to spend $20 million to improve career education in American schools. During a forum that I moderated on Capitol Hill, Dimon outlined his education funding plan alongside former New York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg. Diamond says to work closely with Mr. Trump on ways for private businesses to partner with public schools. It cannot be done by government alone. Okay, these are local decisions. So that what you need in New Orleans, what you need in Colorado, what you need, and there are tons of jobs. So you, you know, so there are radiology, machine tools, uh, uh, coding, accounting, uh, all these various jobs, and they're open. And a lot of these jobs pay forty, fifty, sixty thousand dollars. You can get some of them. Out of high school, you know, the aviation school in New York City, these kids, mostly minority, travel a long time ago there. They graduate. I've got how many graduate a year. Everyone gets a job, average pay $60,000. And that gives them the dignity of life, you know, and the dignity of a job. And you talk about social cohesion, inability to have a family. That's what it is. It doesn't stop them from going to college. It doesn't stop them from starting a company. It doesn't stop any of that kind of stuff, but it just gives people uh, hope. So. And if you take a look at our public school systems, this country, we used to be in the top 10 worldwide. Today, we're in the top 50, barely. I think it's fair to say that our public schools have been a total failure on average across this country. The school systems are run for the providers rather than the beneficiaries. It is really hard to argue that we shouldn't do something dramatically different in our public schools. Every year, we refuse to better train our teachers or to remove those who can't accept or won't accept training and get better. Every year, we are taking hundreds of thousands of kids and condemning them to a life of poverty. They will never catch up. You can watch J.P. Morgan Chase CEO Jamie Dimon live Thursday on CBS This Morning.